This is Chris from EFX. Welcome to our setup tutorial for the EFX frame. In this video, I'll be showing you how to connect your mobile device to the new EFX frame. To begin, you'll first need to download the EFX app. You can do so by focusing your mobile camera on this QR code shown on screen. Click the pop-up notification to be taken to the App Store where you can begin your free download. After you've downloaded the EFX app, let's power up the EFX frame by plugging the power adapter into the power source. Then, plug the DC power plug into the EFX controller located at the rear or side of the EFX frame. Now that you have all of your hardware set up, let's establish your mobile connection. Start by opening the EFX app. Keep in mind, if this is the first time setting up your EFX frame, after powering the EFX controller, your frame should now be rapidly flashing in red, green, and blue. As a new user, you will need to begin by creating an EFX account. From the gear icon in the top left corner, click on Sign In or Create an Account and follow the prompts to conclude your registration. Once complete, you are ready to sign into your account. Now, you are ready to connect your device to the EFX frame. Click on the plus icon in the top right corner and select Connect Device to Wi-Fi Network. Select Open Wi-Fi Settings this will transfer you to the Wi-Fi settings of your mobile device. From here, connect to the LED NetX network. Once your EFX frame is connected to your mobile device, let's complete the setup by connecting the frame to your local Wi-Fi network, allowing you to control your EFX frame from wherever you are. To continue, return back to the EFX app and follow the system prompt. Lastly, give your device a name. This will facilitate seamless control over your network of EFX products. Now that you are connected, you can control the colors of your EFX print from anywhere. Thank you for watching this setup tutorial. If you should have any further questions, please send us an email at info at efximagery.com.